Hi, I'm Miss Janet from Congregation Temple B'nai Yehuda. Today I'm going to read The Fox Walked Alone by Barbara Reed. Night after night, the fox walked alone. He came home to a bed made of feathers and bone. He hunted at night, he slept through the day. Fox walked alone, he liked it that way. But then one day, Fox woke up, he slipped out of his lair. He looked, he listened, he sniffed. There was something in the air. Oh, that crazy fox, the ravens said. What is he doing out of his bed? Two mice ran under Fox's nose. A mole bumped in to Fox's toes. Two tortoises, a pair of hares. The fox was not expecting bears. There is something going on, Fox thought. I'll take a little walk. Why not? But just in case these strangers bite, I will follow safely out of sight. Fox walked until his paws were sore. He had never walked so far before. Oh, that crazy fox, the raven said. One rolled her eyes, one shook his head. The creature stopped to rest, piling into one big nest. Yahoo, fox, said kangaroo. Leopard saved a spot for you. So tooth and claw, fur and feather, they all lay down to sleep together. At first light, they were on their way. It wasn't safe. They couldn't stay. The sky was odd. The wind was wrong. Fox thought he better tag along. And every place they hurried through, more creatures joined them, two by two. They crossed the wasteland, bare and dead. A ruined city laid ahead. Fox wished that he had stayed in bed. Oh, that crazy fox, the raven said. picked their way in single file. Fox figured that it would take a while. He tried to find a bite to eat and lost himself in dead-end streets. He heard a cry. Did someone call? Caught in a cage in a market stall, two doves cried, Fox, it's up to you. Oh, help us please, we need to come too. And Fox knew just what to do. He opened the door and out they flew. They circled back and cooed, thank you. Now follow us, we'll guide you through. They flew that fox straight through the maze of crooked streets and alleyways. Over a hill, around a bend, at last, they were at journey's end. But standing on the dusty plain was something Fox could not explain. Is this why we've come so far? Then someone said, oh, there you are. You're the one I'm waiting for. The, pl the pair played leapfrog to the door. As Noah welcomed one and all, the steady rain began to fall. Oh, that clever fox, the ravens cried, quick as a wink, they flew inside. 